through this uh, program we visited uh, several forest ecosystems both private owned and also state forest and we visited several long term research experiments we are also uh, sitting together with uh, the faculty members from university of new hampshire and um, conducting uh, and thinking about to have some short term research project on different research topics so as part of this partnership, we really hope to develop uh, actual collaborative studies uh, over in Bangladesh where uh, we can work together to better understand what is happening, why it is happening, and what we can do to help prevent or solve problems. As I've been learning more about Bangladesh through my conversations with the Bangladeshi scholars, I've come to realize just how immense some of the challenges Bangladesh is facing around issues of climate change and water resources. And I've also been so inspired by the creative ideas that they're bringing forth to um, try to uh, solve and address some of these challenges that they're facing. I think this, uh, these experiences and will help us to build capacities and uh, strong collaboration and the most uh, notably the student will be benefit uh, from these experiences which I will share through uh, lecture and uh, training and seminar. We also have seen that the extension people from UNH they have created some good practice guidelines for different kind of stakeholders and we feel that uh, in uh, the forest department of Bangladesh we, we can do something similar to that. So that is one take uh, home message for me. We are learning from each other. The UNH colleagues they are learning the actual problems, the, what we are facing that is uh, new to them and they, they want to find uh, solutions and from UNH uh, we are Actually, we gather different uh, information materials and um, tools and techniques and so that, that can help us to uh, replicate those uh, methods and, and we can bring them uh, back to Bangladesh and implement in our areas to find a solution. So one of the, the real connection points for me, really from the get-go of this opportunity, was to be able to share ideas with people looking at mangrove restoration ecology um, in a completely different geography than I've ever been to or worked in. Um, what was really neat in that experience was that the tools that I use in a salt marsh, um, I can pick up and bring to a mangrove system and ask the very same questions. We actually as a team are working to develop a water balance model to understand the watershed management in, in Bangladesh. The people are going to face severe water scarcity in the future. So uh, I was looking for opportunity to uh, collaborate with uh, people for watershed modeling because uh, watershed modeling will answer some of the pressing questions that we have as we didn't have uh, that kind of capacity in, in, in Bangladesh. We've been uh, sharing with the fellows visiting us the, um, the water balance model, which is um, a tool that we use to understand the hydrology, the water quantity and water quality, which is something that's potentially very useful to apply in Bangladesh. After participating in these programs, I have a plan to share what I got from here to make a training programs or workshops uh, for sharing my knowledge. This opportunity has been really, really um, kind of motivating for me in the sense that they have such deep knowledge about the, the, the issues they face in their country. I, I can tell they're a dedicated team to collaborate with. I think we both have that collective drive, that shared interest to make this project a, a success. The College of Life Sciences and Agriculture at the University of New Hampshire has a long and strong history of teaching, research, and service in the fields of forestry and climate science. And we know that the critical issues facing our ecosystems are globally connected. And to best address these issues, our researchers need to be globally connected as well. The Forestry and Climate Science Exchange Program will leave researchers and practitioners in Bangladesh and the United States better equipped to bring a diverse set of perspectives to the challenges we are navigating in our forest systems. Climate change issue is not a uh, national issue, it's an international issue. So if we exchange our knowledge, if we exchange our technical support, then it may be better for Bangladesh and better for all over the world. We live in one world and it is our duty to make our earth safe for our future generations. So in this connected world most of the problems are global 
and uh, when we act locally our activities affect uh, global communities so working together uh, is the best way to solve uh, those problems.